What's up, everybody? Welcome to Podcast Now. I'm Alex, and in this video, we have another State of Play slash PlayStation Showcase rumor. And the reason I say that, right, is because whenever you talk about these things, people say this is the game where any insider on the planet tries to guess when one of these things happens within the next, like, three years. And whoever gets it right is going to win some sort of award or prize because nobody has gotten it right, right? There's been all these rumors of it, and then nothing really has happened. So we got Jeff Grubb. He's the next candidate it up and he talked about two different things now to be fair right a little pessimistic at the beginning of this video but to be fair this has already kind of been circulating he's the next person to talk about it. so this isn't gigantically new however you know prominent name he does get a lot of things right he basically says two things one there's going to be a state of play in early March slash late February I think his specific wording was like a month or slightly sooner than a month which could be late February early Early March. He called it low key. He said apparently it's going to be pretty lackluster and don't get your hopes up too high. So that was that one. That's the March, you know, state of play. So probably just one of these focused ones, right, where it's games that, you know, some people are going to be into, some people aren't, but it's not going to be, it's not going to make a big bang, right? And then he talks about, well, they're holding off on showing other things because they're going to do something around the June E3 time, and it's going to be a PlayStation showcase. So... Don't want to get too excited. Don't want to like say it as gospel, but that would be absolutely incredible. And that's kind of what we all want, right? You've probably seen the memes online of like Nintendo and Xbox partying or that SpongeBob meme where Squidward is, you know, in his house and he's PlayStation. He's looking at these two having fun. And that's kind of the situation, right? We had our Nintendo Direct. It was fantastic. We've had Xbox things. We're going to have more Xbox things as uh, the time goes on. And then Sony's over there, right? Now they're doing that Super Bowl ad. So that's, I suppose, one. One thing we'll see if that's even something that's big but at least this would start to kickstart it now the june idea right if you do spider-man 2 in june that would be a very very quick turnaround from you're not announcing it because you already did but you would announce it back in you know september of 2021 and then you take an entire almost two years off show it again and the game comes out like three, four months later, that would be wild. And I kind of feel like that would be a first for that kind of situation. So there you go. The newest rumor. We'll see if it's right. As I've always said, like I'll take gaming announcements literally whenever from whoever. I love these kind of things. Um, yes, people have been trying to predict when Sony's going to do something for literally the past like 18 or so months. Somebody's going to get it right eventually. And let's hope that this one's right because that means something is right around the corner. Let me know what you guys think. Make sure you guys are subscribed. Bell icon turned on. And I hope to see you all on the next one.